Okay, and we're back. So, and they put in your name thing. I found it aggravating, so I did half of it and finished it. But it doesn't really matter. And as you know, see, there's points. And there's medals. Really. Anyway, I'm skipping the intro because I already did the intro uh, at the beginning of the playlist. If you guys want to see that, go ahead. Uh, Army Man channel, uh, kudos and thank you for posting those up. Uh, anyway, loading level one. Whenever it decides to load, you know that you know that good old 99% uh, bug. Anyway. Here's a crash helicopter we were. So let's run backwards. <laughs> nope. And well good thing we ran backwards a little bit, I guess. I mean nothing in the helicopter, so let's go ahead and go on. But as you can see here, like I said before, it is just like a real gun shooter. Uh, but you can't pick your path. You see, uh like I want to go left. I want to go left. I want to go left. Why can't I go left? No. Well, fine. I'll go right then. Anyway, it appears we're on some beach, and uh, the tans look more grayish than tans, but uh, okay. But yeah, you you guys can sort of see why I'm I'm very underwhelmed, um, and why I'm sounding annoyed in this LP because, I mean, if you played any any of the Iron Man series, even the top down ones, uh, but then you look at this. I mean, I'll even go as far to say as the Army Man RTS. <laughs> Just look at all of that and then look at this. What exactly is this? <laughs> anyway, apparently it takes place uh probably I would probably say post or dirt or mid uh air Lansing air, uh just due to the uh due to the vehicles. Uh like before there was there was a Mustang, uh which is not normally used in most of the Army Man series, as far as the Sergeant Shiro's line is concerned. And uh, that plane will be coming off and on the screen a lot. It's just more there to annoy you. I, I can't figure out how to kill it, if you're supposed to. And here we go. Here's what I was talking about with camera angles. Yeah, they expect you to be able to shoot that, but yet you're fighting the camera while he's shooting you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. Seriously, what in the world was 3DO thinking on this? Okay, now apparently we're playing Commando. <laughs> Yeah, I, I made a Nintendo reference there. Yes. <laughs> We're going that far back. Seriously, this game plays more like Commando than it does anything else. <laughs> In fact, it's ha making me half tempted to do a compare and contrast just to show you how much it, it resembles Commando to me. And Commando is a lot better than this. Ugh. Seriously, what is this? Uh, but anyway, yeah. I don't know what to talk about. This game really is a downer. I'm really disappointed. Like, like I said, I had I had so much built up expectations of the of. You know, seeing you know the comedy that 3DO is known for, like seeing him go through that Hoover personality would have been hilarious. Or uh, seeing him like 
be like Trap or all them. Uh, that would have been that would have been funny and hilarious to see more of their personality traits. But no, 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 no. We get this. What is this? And supposedly there's a, a secret power weapon or thing called a bioweapon, which is what that thing is above, up above. Um, I don't know what it is. Uh, I don't really think you actually need to show it off either. Hopefully maybe in later levels, but... <sighs> yeah. Y you guys should definitely feel the mental fa face palm I'm having. Seriously, yeah. even while I'm doing this LP, I've got, I'm pinching my forehead in frustration. Oh, evidently that's how you build them up. You have to have a like, hand grenade strike. Well, I don't know about that. I found that out post commentary. Oh, yeah. Anyway, what are you expected to do here? Just you just walk? I said what? Um, really? Uh, if I if I had if I could find the um trailers and ad I mean not the trailers but I mean the adverts for this thing you guys would see an entirely different game in mind when you see this this uh, and I remember growing up playing with Sarge's Heroes one and two uh actually seeing the commercials I had a lot higher expectations than this what what the heck. Um, uh, seriously. Anyway, I'll be posting more Estigo videos after this. Um, uh, so pretty much, like I said before, I had like 30, 35 minutes of footage for the Easy 8. I already posted uh, the first half, first third of it. But there's more to it. Not sure what that's supposed to be. Because most of the bombers are B-17s. That's way too small for that. As far as army man scale. You know, enjoy more camera fun. So, hmm. But yeah, uh, for those interested, like I said, Estigo is supposedly going for either open beta or open release around December 4th. Uh, supposedly. So if you're a Gundam fan or just looking for a good, quick uh, MMO that uh, is similar to. Oh. <coughs> Uh, I apologize. Uh, similar to uh, what was that game again? God dang it! <laughs> Oops. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. That, that, that's that's my uh, interpretation. No, but really, I can't remember what the game was. I I remember the suits of the game. But I don't remember what the game was. And so forgive me there. But it has like lilies and stuff like that. Assault lilies and stuff. But uh. I'll look it up and post it next video. <laughs> Cause I feel stupid forgetting it. Darn it, it's the Department of Energy. Arrgh. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, really? I forgot though. Um. Also, uh, there's rumors that Yusigo uh it might be under uh. Support by Bandai for that uh, private server. Uh, so uh, I don't know anything about if I should or not. 
also heard tell that there's been some GM issues with the uh, foreign player base, uh, them wanting to be overbearing and not letting American players be able to rant and rave. I am not quite sure I want to get into that or not, but I I'm sorry, but uh, people should be allowed to rant and rave. End of story. Uh, I've, I've already experienced enough the uh, foreign mindset on some games. Uh, Fantasy at Earth Zero, for example, uh, they actually coded maps and regions for homelands to be attacked and conquered and stuff, but yet they had a written rule that stated that you're not allowed to invade. They had, they had this unwritten, the Japanese and uh, player base had an unwritten rule saying you don't invade those. Why? Why? They developed all of that area. You should be allowed to play it. I'm sorry. That is stupid. It makes no sense. But yeah, um, I mean, I, I'm I'm sorry. I mean, I know that there's this respect thing going on, but at the same time, it's a war game. You're, like there is supposed to be some stupidity of overzealousness and being stupid and going Mongolian horde on somebody. Uh, I'm sorry. I mean, I can I can understand the uh <coughs> sorry for coughing. I can understand the mindset after playing uh you know, crossfire and uh sudden attack and all them that you could understand why people would hate the uh hit the troll mindset, you know, the whole uh, QQ and trolling and all that. I can understand why I hate that mindset. But at the same time, that is actually an understandable part. They should be able, should be allowed to brag. They should be able to rant. They should be able to whine. They should be able to complain, gripe, bitch, yell, uh, stick their finger in the air and or stick a feather in their cap and call them howdy doody, or however you want to, they should be allowed to. I'm sorry. It's, it's, it's just part of that territory. I mean, that's part of the game. If you and part of the genre, if you're if you're not wanting to be a part of that genre, uh, all you have to do is uh, play something else, or just ignore the chat. I mean, really. Uh, But, uh, oh, look, look at the barrels. Does that not remind you of Commando? Seriously, it is making me want to. <laughs> Why? 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 Look at the camera angle. Oh, dang it, what is with that? I nearly kill myself with the barrel just trying to get through that. I got an extra life, apparently. But, um, sir, but anyway, oh, it looks like we got a grenade in here. I'm sorry, but due to your scale, uh, I don't find this intimidating. The grenade throws less than the, than the bullet. Uh huh. Ow. <laughs> yeah, honestly, though, what is with this? Okay, a mortarman would be more fun than this. Having mortarman would be a thousand times more entertaining because then at least there's an actual threat. But this, come on. 
<coughs> Sorry. My throat's a little dry. But seriously, what is with this? <laughs> um, I will go back in the Fire Emblem some later on. Uh, and hopefully you might get some Tax Ball uh, plays going up too. Just so you guys can see what Tax Ball is like. Uh, Beezy, uh, he's one of the people on my uh, subscriber list down below. Uh, he plays Tax Ball and he probably has some videos up. If you guys want to see it, uh, also uh, some I have some other shoutouts. Um, Mag Shea made a yet another channel. Um, I'm not even going to bother with <laughs> his new one, but uh, if you go under his original account, I think you can easily find it. And it looks like I got a shotgun. Boy, we are really trying to go commando, aren't we? Because that, this is the same upgrade scale, seriously, as the game Commando. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised. But anyway. Oh, there's your bioweapon token thingy. If you guys, like I said, I'm not going to bother using it because it looks apparently like I'm at the end of the level, but eh. But anyway, um, yeah, MagShay has yet another channel. Is bringing his total up to three. I wish the guy would just understand that he can make mistakes and just keep everything in one channel, but yeah, I doubt he's going to do that, so. Oh well. Um, oh, uh, another uh, YouTube account uh, also that also made a second account, uh, Katari Rantan, uh, or something to that effect. Uh, is going to try to make uh, LPs of uh, Pokemon ROM hacks. <coughs> uh, I can't really give you the details on that one because I don't, I can't seem to have it, find the account. But at the same time, uh, I figured I would uh, let you guys know so you could go on uh, her channel and uh, go see from there. Uh, let's see. Also, I had another uh, subscriber, uh, Lupus Gaming. Uh, I didn't see your channel yet, so I don't know if I want to subscribe or not to your channel. But uh, go a shout out to the him. Uh, uh, pretty much, I'm running out of things to say here. This is how bad this game is. Other than think, I can't. Act I ran out of things to talk about with the game already, and this is the first level. That shows you how bad this game is. Look. And if that was a World at War uh, PT boat, he would have already been dead. I'm sorry. You would have already been dead. But anyway, now to show you the scores, and then I will go on to the next level. So, uh, later.